Hey guys, it's Tony, and uh, today I'm going to be doing something that I've only done one video for way back, not really that far back, but it was quite a while ago, and it was um, a CD review, and I just got the CD today in the mail, and I'm really excited about it, because I've been obsessed with this band for like a while, and there's not many reviews of it online, so I decided to do it, as you, this is my shirt that I got. And then, this is the poster. If you couldn't tell by now, the CD that I'm reviewing is Glass Cloud, The Royal Thousand. Um, I'm obsessed. I, I love Of Mice and Men and all. That's the only reason I'm kind of turned off by this band. But Jarrah kind of seemed to change. He's still kind of like an ass. But, you know, he has a good voice, so whatever. So, um, the track list is, uh, White Flag, If He Dies, He Dies, Falling in Style, Ivy and Wine, Prelude for a Ghost, All Along, She Is Well, Nothing Can Be Ill, Counting Sheep, Memorandum, I don't know how to say that, um, From Made and Now, and, uh, it's amazing, basically, there's not much to say, um, I will tell you my favorite songs, which are, uh, White Flag, If He Dies, He Dies, Ivy and Wine, Prelude for a Ghost, um, She Is Well, Nothing Can Be Ill, you know, kind of the f more famous ones, just because, uh, I guess that's kind of the reason why they're famous, I mean, the other ones were kind of just sane, I guess you could say, um, all the ones that I cho uh, I really like all have something that I really like in them. Like, there's this guy on YouTube who did a review of this. I don't remember his name, but, um, he was one of the few that did a very in-depth interview, uh, not interview, review of this, and, uh, everything he says in that is true. If you, if you want to just skip this and go watch that, well, I might link it in the description, because he explains everything really well. Um, but, uh, yeah, everything he says is really true. He says, uh, that every song on here almost every song on here has one standout moment that you will listen to just to you will listen to go back to the song just to hear that one part and it's so true like i was she is well nothing can be ill that guitar thing is freaking insane the the vocals and the random heavy parts and like um if he dies he dies is just amazing um the ending of ivy and wine really gets to me because uh it just sounds really, like, pretty, I guess you could say. It sounds peaceful, and it's a weird t kind of peaceful, because it's still metal, but, I mean, it's, it's really cool. Um, also, in Ivy and Wine, I really like the chorus. It's an amazing chorus. I don't know why. It just sounds really good. Um, yeah, overall, it's an amazing album. I, I'm i obsessed with Joshua. He's insane. I need to take a guitar lesson from this guy because I mean I play a little bit of guitar not that much but he and like he's a freaking expert like he's in, he's insane I he's crazy I don't know how he do, how he does the stuff that he does and Jerry became a, a much better vocalist definitely and they put on awesome shows they like with with two guitarists like with four members it's kind of hard to pull off a, a great show when you're a metal band like Kind of metal, I guess you could say. But, uh, yeah, they're insane. They, they're they they're really good. Um, but, yeah, that's basically all I have to say. Uh, I was kind of bored right now, so I decided to make a video. But uh, I love this album, so I just decided to do a it. I decided to link it, you know, whatever. But uh, definitely check out the, the guy down low. Uh, he does a much better review than me. Um, I, but I'm really glad I got this CD. I've been wanting it for quite a while and I've been obsessed for the longest time because the first time I heard about them was in a My Cement video. I don't remember what video, but you can scroll through all my feed if you want and find the comment that I wrote to this guy who said, uh, now Jerry Rash is in a new band and they're much better than a My Cement. And that pissed me off because I'm like obsessed with a My Cement. So I would look them up and I wasn't pleased at all. And I replied, I'm like, uh, it's not even because of My Cement is one of my favorite bands. Uh, Glass Cloud sucks compared to them. 
I take that all back. Seriously, uh, I'm not gonna say which one I like more because they're both definitely high up there. But uh, first off, Seosin beats them all. But I mean, still. But uh, yeah, it's definitely a really good album if you like this type of music. Definitely pick it up. Definitely go watch them live. Um, it's they're they're worth listening to if you. And you might not like it at first. Let's just say that. But uh, for most people. Um, you'll either like it right away or you'll get used to it after a while or you just hate it because you know reasons your own reasons I don't really know what they are but yeah so that's basically all I have to say it's I thought it, I don't know how I ever didn't like this but um, I'm definitely glad I went back to it because if I didn't I would not be holding this in my hand right now seriously amazing definitely a great album um, it's definitely something to listen to so, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see ya.